Hey, what's happening, everyone? It's Dan, back with Bruise with Beck. How are you? Happy uh, almost Monday night. Monday night football game's on tonight. Been uh, looking at that game. Kind of looking forward to it. Russell Wilson versus the mediocre Eagles. Sorry, sorry, Philly fans, but just looking forward to seeing what Russell and uh, DK and the rest of the crew can do tonight. Uh, not even a Seattle fan, but, you know, they're exciting. Anyhow, we're on to a... Uh, Another fresh, pretty local, hazy IPA from Mother Earth, uh, which is down in Vista, which is fairly close to San Diego. They've been around for about 10 years now. Um, I may, I don't, I haven't had a lot of their beers. If, if I can, only one I can for sure, I think, say I've had is Cali Creamin, which I may have had a while back, which is kind of their flagship cream ale. Uh, if I remember right, it was, it was, you know, a nice session. Um, it's supposed to kind of have a cream soda feel to it, but that's the one I've had by him. But this is by Mother Earth. It's a uh, cosmic pyrokinesis. Not easy to say. Uh, it is mm, about two and a half weeks in the can, so very fresh. Uh, I was pretty stoked to see it uh, at my local Trader Joe's uh, a few days back, so bought a few of them. Anyhow, it's 6.7 on the Richter, and uh, let's dig in. Wow, I should really get longer nails. Sheesh. Hold on. Okay. Ken, Ken and me weren't getting along. Anyway, here we go. Oof, got to gotta hear the pop. All right, so this one has, again, it's two and a half weeks in the can, 6.7 on the Richter, and it is... By Mother Earth. Um, it has four different types of hops. It's got Mosaic, Eldorado, uh, let's see, Amarillo, and this thing called Belmo, which I think is relatively new, that is uh, supposed to be tropical and even have a little, uh, you know, strawberry essence to us. So people got excited about that. But uh, let's see. There you go. Got, got the nice uh, can logo. Got the nice up front. I mean, again, this is supposed to be based on all the hops and everything it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be citrus, tropical. You might get strawberry. Uh, you know, we'll see. But I am getting that nice, fresh, hop forward uh, smell already. Yeah, that's, that's nice. Uh, nice little. Uh, wave of hops hits you right in the face. Not 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 bitter, but nice. It's the, this one only has 25 IBU. It's not it's not bitter. It's just you you definitely get the hop before you get anything else in here. Um, I would probably say let's see what else what else can I get from that from mosaic. There's mosaic in there, which always is a favorite of mine. Um, so yeah, I get it. You are getting an arrangement of, you know, mixed berry kind of feel to the hops. Um, obviously, most hazies always have citrus. Mosaic definitely has some citrus, uh, powerful citrus. Um, and yeah, it's uh, it, you know it's six seven, so it's so it's not it's not like the last one I think I did, which was like an eight eight double. It's uh, it's fairly medium to thin on the the mouth feel. Yeah, so de definitely, if I didn't know what this was, I would. Eh, it's uh, just because of my knowledge of this, I would. I wouldn't have. I probably would have known it was around around six seven. Most hazies don't go six. I mean, it's it's rare. I feel like that's a standard in the industry. Go six seven, six eight on just a kind of a single hazy IPA. But yeah, it's definitely session feeling. Um, not you know again medium to thin mouth feel. You get yeah. You're getting tropical, floral, citrus. Um, oh, yeah, let me see if I can detect the strawberry. Maybe right at the end, like, as it kind of comes around. it's it, You'd have to really be, you know, thinking about it to detect strawberry. But if you think about it, you, can, you get it right around the end when it's kind of going down your throat. Um, and the aftertaste. So, yeah, nice, nice arrangement. Um, 
down and dirty on this. Uh, pretty, pretty good. I think, I think, uh, you know, I usually just buy single cans from Trader Joe's where I got it, but I think a four pack of this goes for, uh, 1299. So I think I, this goes for, what is it? Um, 325, uh, yeah, 325 a can. So, uh, for 325 in the can, uh, a can and the kind of quality I'm getting, I mean, you know, you can, that's why I wanted this fresh. You definitely get the, uh, just like any IP, hazy IPA, you want you want it super fresh. So I uh, wanted to get this off there. Definitely session feeling with with uh, again how it kind of has a thinner profile to, to the uh, the body. And uh, yeah, it at a five, I would probably give this hmm, probably a four point two to be exact. Um, right in that um, kind of bottom part of a minus uh, feel. Or strong B plus, but um, you know, however you want to interpret that. But yeah, it's uh, it's from you know it's Southern California down near San Diego, Mother Earth. Uh, let me pour the rest. Bottoms up for uh, Russell Wilson and the Seahawks tonight. What's up, Blevins? <laughs> and yeah, hopefully you guys are enjoying your fun day Monday, right? Love Mondays. Uh, I think my next brew is going to be a fairly complex stout, so I'll let you in on that um, soon, uh, probably the next you know, couple days or something like that. But anyway, subscribe to my channel, uh, tap the like button, por favor, and uh, you know, we'll see you around the bend. Good talk.